Hello guys, um, I'm just back. Well, actually, no, I tell a lie. I've been back for about maybe half an hour, I don't know. We just got done filming uh, an episode of Nick and Chris Go the Movies, where we talked about Captain America Winter Soldier. And it was really weird because, like, at the beginning of the review, Nick seemed to really like the movie, and then as the review went on, <laughs> he started to like it less. Just because of fucking cliches and whatnot. And yes, I will admit there are cliches in the movie, but for me, personally, I liked how the movie handled its cliches. I liked how the movie kind of went through. It took this storyline and just kind of, it flowed for me. I loved how it worked. I loved how it handled the story. For me, I like the fact that, say, the Winter Soldier didn't show up a whole lot because it made him that more of a mysterious character. You made him all that more interesting that you don't know a lot about him. And I really liked that. But then when you found out who he was, it was like... Okay, you know, fair enough. I did, I thought it was kind of clever how it did that. Yes, you could say it was cliched, but I thought it was kind of clever. Nick Fury was awesome in it again. Fucking Black Widow, Scarlett Johansson, you know, and Samuel Jackson. Captain America himself, he's just as cool as he ever was, you know. He has that kind of witty sense of humour about him, that superhero sense of humour, the comic book style sense of humour, which I really like. And I like how he goes back and wears his old suit from the first movie. I really like that. Not the shitty one, the proper one. Um, so I really like that. And I dug the plot because I felt that really within the, the S.H.I.E.L.D. organisation there was bound to be a point where it would become corrupt. For a lot of organisations like that there's always going to be a part where it gets corrupt. But I really dug that. But overall, I'm going to finish this now because it's getting close to two minutes. Uh, overall, I really enjoyed this movie. Personally, I preferred it to the original. I would say the original is a bit more fun, like it, it's a lot more loose and fun and whatnot. This one is a lot more serious, I will say. I do think it shouldn't have been as serious as it was. If there was any gripe I had about this movie, it really should have toned down the seriousness a bit because it went a bit far. But other than that, I really dug it. Glenn thought it was okay, Chris thought it was okay, Nick thought it was okay. Me, I really dug it. So far it's uh, I'm trying to think. I'd probably say it was my favourite movie of this year so far. Just I just really enjoyed it. It was on the edge of the seat for me. So, uh, uh, thanks very much for watching this, and I know it's been a while since I've done an iPhone vlog, but fuck you. So, um, should have another Let's Play out fairly soon, and I might be doing a Dragon Car soon, I'm not sure. And, uh, also, it's just that I've been working on stuff with my band. Uh, go in the, li the link in the description, by the way. Uh, you'll find a link to uh, my band's YouTube page. Uh, Aurora Highway, we're called. Uh, it would be great if you guys could go check it out and subscribe to our page. And on there you'll find our website and you'll find links to our, our second EP on iTunes and our first EP on Bandcamp and all that. Uh, yeah, I know how it's gotten to plugging here. But, um... <laughs> So uh, thanks very much for watching this iPhone vlog and I'll catch you guys later.